Now, what if I tell you that there is an app that blocks malware, trackers, and sketchy apps without needing root? And then there is my favorite, a sneaky little vault that hides whatever you drop into it. All this and much more in today's video, where I am diving into some seriously underrated open source apps that you have probably never heard of but definitely need. Excited? So let's get started. Now if regular antivirus apps feels like overprotective parents, Athena is more like a smart no-nonsense bodyguard who doesn't nag but always has your back. It's a security and privacy app for Android that blocks malware, trackers, shady apps and even sneaky background connections all without needing root access. Now here is a real life scenario. Now have you ever downloaded a random flashlight app and later realized it was quietly sending data to who knows where? With this app, you can simply block that app's internet access entirely. And boom, flashlight still works, but your data stays put. It's like cutting the gossip line while keeping the lights on. The app also gives you fine-grained control. Block websites by category, stop fingerprinting attempts, and even monitor network traffic if you're curious about what's happening under the hood. And the best part, everything runs locally on your phone offline. And despite all this power, the interface is clean and modern, so you don't feel like you're configuring a spaceship just to stay safe. Now imagine you're browsing or chatting and stumble upon a word you don't know. Instead of jumping between apps to look it up, you can instantly get its meaning with notification dictionary. This handy app lets you find words definition directly from any app where you can select text. All you have to do is highlight the word, select find meaning and a notification will pop up with the definition. You can tap the notification to see more meaning, copy it to your clipboard or even share it with others. And the best part, the app works offline so you can rely on it anytime, anywhere. This app uses definitions from Wik Dictionary giving you a broad range of meanings. It is also open source, lightweight and completely ad free so you get a smooth and distraction free experience. Now, if you're looking for a simple no-frill wallpaper manager for Android, Peristyle is a great option. It is designed to eliminate the unnecessary clutter found in other apps, allowing you to easily browse and select your locally stored wallpapers. With multiple folder support, you can keep things organized and the ability to tag wallpaper makes finding your favorite a breeze. This app even scans no media dictionaries, which is perfect if you want to hide certain wallpapers from your gallery. You can apply blur and color filters before setting any wallpaper, adding a creative touch to your home screen. The app also supports auto wallpaper changer, letting you create dedicated folders and tags for different screens. This app values privacy. There are no ads, no tracking and no unnecessary permissions and it doesn't even require internet access. If your brain is basically a cluttered bookmark bar with thousands I'll read later tabs, Memno might just save your sanity. It's a neat little app for saving links with notes so you don't forget why you saved them in the first place. Now say you're planning a trip, you find a cool Airbnb, a must visit cafe and a travel blog with secret spots. Instead of dumping them into a messy browser folder, you save them in this app. Each link gets a title, description and image preview automatically. And later you don't have to scroll endlessly. Just search by category or even use the unique six digit code this app gives each group. The app works offline too, looks clean with rounded tiles and smooth navigations and lets you organize links into custom groups. Think of this app as your personal vault of links and notes, organized, searchable and way smarter than just dumping everything in Chrome bookmarks. If Google Maps feels a bit too nosy and data hungry, Comaps is like its chill privacy respecting cousin who just want to help you get where you are going. It's free open source community built and based on open street maps so the people making it are regular users like you and me, not some giant ad machine. And the best part is that everything works offline. Imagine you are hiking in the mountains, no signal, no Wi-Fi but you still want to find the nearest water source or trail. Comaps has you covered with detailed outdoor maps, contour lines, campsites and even offline Wikipedia articles. You can download maps in advance and navigate with voice directions for walking, cycling or driving. It's also lightweight, battery friendly and ad free so your phone isn't secretly training for a marathon while running it. You can bookmark spots, record tracks, check subway routes and even edit maps to make them better for everyone. 
Next up we have Air, which is like a secret vault on your phone, except instead of holding gold bars, it keeps your private photos and files safe from curious apps and let's be real sometimes curious people. Unlike a standalone file manager, this app feels like it's baked right into Android itself, which makes it surprisingly smooth to use. Now here is where it's super practical. Say a friend borrow your phone to look at a picture and you really don't want them accidentally swiping into that private folder. With this app, anything you move into its storage simply won't show up in other apps like gallery, WhatsApp, Instagram, none of them. It's like your file suddenly put on an invisibility cloak. You can organize folders, lock access with password and even set an auto lock timer so the app shuts itself after a while, which is perfect if you forget to. It also supports external storage so you can stash big files on an encrypted SD card and still access them later on your computer via USB. If your phone gallery is secretly 80% meme, recipe, and random screenshots you swore you would look at later, then Short Studio is basically your cleanup crew. It's a screenshot manager designed to keep that chaos under control without making you scroll endlessly just to find that one Wi-Fi password you saved three weeks ago. Now what makes it super practical is how smartly it organizes everything. Say you took 10 screenshots of a recipe, 3 of your bank OTPs and 5 funny tweets. This app can automatically sort tag and even detect duplicates so you don't end up with 12 copies of the same punchline. You can also create custom collection making it easy to separate work stuff from random internet gold. The app is privacy friendly and it even monitors in the background to catch new screenshots as soon as you take them. Our next app is called Round Sync, which is your regular file manager but with superpowers. On the surface, it looks clean and minimal, nothing too flashy. But the fun begins when you hit the little plus button. Suddenly, you are not just managing files on your phone, you are pulling in Google Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive or pretty much any cloud service or clone support. Now let's say you are working on a project on your laptop, saving everything in Google Drive. With this app, you can schedule it to automatically sync those files to your phone every evening. No more last minute oops forget to download that file moment before a meeting. You will have the latest version waiting for you neatly organized. It also handles the basic list, move, rename, delete without fuss. Plus you can stream media directly or even serve files over FTP, HTTP, web dev and DLNA. So if you are still stuck with the stock file manager, round sync is like upgrading from a bicycle to a motorbike. So guys, these are some of the most underrated open source apps that you should definitely give a try. So which of the previously mentioned app you like the most? Do you know of any other application that we should have added to this list? Do let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. And for more future videos like this, do consider subscribing and hit that bell icon so that you never miss any future videos from Extreme Droid.